All right, everybody, we're working through the quadratics, uh, quadratics functions and equations review. We're on question 6C, and we're just supposed to put this into vertex form, which means completing the square. So the very first thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to move that plus 2. I'm going to get y equals here, and I'm going to move that 2 way out of the way, that plus 2, so that it's not, I don't inadvertently incorporate it in any of the work that I'm doing in the next step or so here. Then what I'm going to do is remove by factoring. I'm going to factor out that leading coefficient out of the quadratic and the linear term. Now, when I do that here, okay, remember this is, when I factor that out, factoring is involving division. So this is going to end up becoming 2 thirds x. Okay, now I'm going to close off the parentheses there to push the 2 out of the way here. But 2 thirds x. Okay, now, I hope that makes sense. Okay, just a little bit of division here, and I know that's not particularly fun. But anyway, let's keep moving forward here. Now, I know, awkward as it sounds, that there is a 2 somewhere in there. That, that when you, when we uh, expand out binomials here by squaring, the middle term is going to be constantly doubled. So, in this 2 thirds, there is a factor of 2. Now, there is a factor of 2 in the numerator. And so, 2 thirds is the same as 2 times 1 third which tells me two steps down when I have this thing factored at the very end that inside the, the binomial here that's being squared that this is going to end up being x plus one-third squared. I get that from the one-third that I found right there. So I've already got the majority of the, the vertex form down. I just need to figure out what the vertical translation is. So what I do is I look back up to, the, to this little expression that I came up with and I'm going to complete the square. So what I have to do now is I have to add that number squared. So one third squared is one ninth and then I subtract one ninth. Okay, so that the overall change to the equation is, is nothing. Okay, one ninth minus one ninth is zero. Now what I gotta do is I gotta get that negative term out and uh, combine it with the the vertical translation that I have out here. So this will be 3 times x squared plus 2 thirds x minus 1 ninth. <coughs> sorry. I'm oh, sorry, plus 1 ninth. I don't know why I said that. Plus 1 ninth. And then I'm going to take that negative nine, 1 ninth out, but I'm going to do it by multiplying by 3. Okay, so 3 times negative 1 ninth okay, is going to be negative 3 over 9 which is negative one-third plus two. And then the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take and subtract one-third from two. And after a little bit of work here, you'll find that that's going to be, oh, sorry, not five-sixths, not five-sixths, five-thirds. Sorry, as soon as I was doing it in my head here, I was multiplying the, the two by the three to get the common denominators. Uh, but the denominator stays the same, so it's going to be five-thirds. So this is one-third uh, plus uh, a six-thirds and put those together and you get five-thirds there.